I've seen you in the newspaper. You are a reporter? I'm a journalist. Be patient. Hi, so today we are going to focus on the animated movie. The Adventures of Tintin, The Secret of the Unicorn. Now, if you are in the United States of America, you might have not heard that additional title, Secret of the Unicorn. But I heard it because I was in Australia. Now, knowing that additional title, uh, it helps you to identify from which book this Tintin movie is derived. It's derived from the comic book under the name, The Secret of the Unicorn. The Secret of the Unicorn is the first Tintin book, the first Tintin comic book, to be based on a complicated story. It was such a complicated story that the story continued to a second book. Therefore, it became the first. It's the first Tintin comic book to be a two-part series. sank his own ship. Why? Why would he send the unicorn to the bottom of the sea? It doesn't say. History is never truly in the past, young man. History is in our blood. Now, The Secret of the Unicorn is a two-part series. The others were... There were some others later. The Seven Crystal Balls and The Prisoners of the Sun. This was also a two-part TV series, which followed a little bit after The Secret of the Unicorn. The Secret of the Unicorn and Red Jack and Stresher. Now, the movie doesn't derive much from the Red Jack and Stresher. Only the ending part of Red Jack and Stresher comes in this movie, The Secret of the Unicorn. I've seen you in the newspaper. You are a reporter? I'm a journalist. Tintin comic story to be based on two comic books. Now, The Secret of the Unicorn is a two-part series. It's the first Tintin comic book to be a two-part series. The others were... there were some others later. 